Welcome to Strawberry Land. <laughs> I'm glad you decided to drop by, because today is a very special day for Strawberry Shortcake. You see, today Strawberry Shortcake moves out of her old house, and all of her friends have been busy helping her get ready for the move to her new house. <laughs> Even their pets are helping. Now that everybody's ready, I'm going to show you sides of my trip around the world and all the wonderful friends I made in all the different countries. Okay, Custard. Light. <laughs> Camera. Action. Oh! <laughs> I first visited Mexicoco, where I met Cafe Ove and her pet burro, Burrito. Cafe Ove taught me to do the Mexicoco hat dance. Wow! And this is who I met in China Cup. My good friends, Almond Tea and Marzi Panda. Oh, I wish I could have stayed with them a little longer. Oh, and this is Mint Tulip and her pet duck, Marsh Mallard. Hollandaise was so much fun. That's where they make Dutch chocolate, you know. This is my good friend, Crepe Suzette, and her French poodle, Eclair. Settle down, Pupcake. And last, but certainly not least, the English twins, Lem and Ada, in Pickle Dilly Circus. Oh, it was so hard to tell them apart without the help of their pet, Sugar Wolfer. They were all such wonderful friends. I wish I could see them again. Well, Strawberry, now that you're moving into a big new house, you'll have room for them all to visit. Oh, you're right, Blueberry. My new house is big enough for all my friends. And right now, our job is to get you moved into your new house. Right, Pupcake? <laughs> oh, Pupcake, you'll never move this box with me on it. right here but now it's time to pack your gear everybody's gotta go somewhere sometime this time you're the one so pack up all your stuff and put it in a truck and we'll have this moving done pack them up and move them out it's time to move to your brand new house pack them up and move them out pack them up and move them out Pack them up and move them out When you move to your brand new house Well, it looks like Strawberry Shortcake made some great friends on her trip. And I'm sure she told them all about Strawberry Land and how each day here is as pleasant and nice as the next. <laughs> but then there's some people that try to spoil every good day, and I mean those two double-dealing desperados, sour grapes, and the peculiar purple pineman of porcupine beef. Our grapes. You have arrived just in time to witness the commencement of my maniacal master plan. <laughs> master plan? Why, you don't intend to try to top my villainy, do you, You Kirby? bet your fang-tooth back scratcher I do. There, there, dregs. My master plan will allow me to spoil strawberry shortcake's fun forever. <laughs> oh, come now, Kirby. Surely you're overestimating yourself, as usual. Oh, yeah? Well, stick around and take a peek. My plan is perfection. So sinister, so sleek. For I am the peculiar purple pie man of Porcupine Peak. Ratatatatatatata, ratata. Yeah. Oh boy, you sure don't know how much stuff you've collected until you have to move. 
You don't have to tell me, Strawberry. Cupster and I'll go on ahead and have everything ready. Bye! See you at my new house! I wish there was some way for us to meet Strawberry's wonderful new friends. They seem so very nice. Uh, have a party! Yeah, a surprise party. Great idea, Lime Chiffon. A surprise housewarming party for Strawberry Shortcake. And we'll invite all her new friends to come and visit. We can all bring her a housewarming present. And I know just the gift. We can ask all friends to bring along their favorite recipes so that Strawberry Shortcake will have all the best recipes in Strawberry Land. Ah, uh -huh. my plan works. Teaching these stupid berry birds to talk was the most painful ordeal of my entire life. But it was well worth it. Uh -huh. But it was well worth it. They must be incredibly stupid birds if they repeat anything you say. Anything you say? Ew! Aha! Uh -huh. Anything anyone says, they repeat. I've taught them to eavesdrop, remember, then speak. For I'm the peculiar purple pie man I of Porcupine Peak. Sure, sure, sure. Stupid birds. And don't come back until you've got more information. <laughs> so you see, sour grapes, my berry birds will tell me everything I need to know to spoil strawberry shortcakes fun. <laughs> and as always, Herpy, I have a much more insidious idea. If we had all the best recipes in Strawberry Land, we could put them together and have the world's greatest cookbook. What a despicable idea, Sour Grips! I'll steal all Strawberry Shortcake's recipes, and that will really spoil her party. <laughs> what a horrendous noise! <laughs>